pool or no pool? That's what we're talking about today. Jackie Baker, your local realtor with Coldwell Banker Realty in Bergen County, New Jersey. I post videos to my channel here every Wednesday and I talk about all things real estate. So if that is something of interest to you, be sure to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll never miss a video. So this week I'm talking about pool or no pool, the pros and cons of buying a house with a pool. So let's talk about pros and cons of buying a house with a pool. So first, the pros. Obviously, you have your own little private oasis. You don't have to travel anywhere to go swimming. You don't have to go to the beach. You can just run down to your backyard and jump into your pool and you can entertain and have people come over and barbecue and it's just a great thing to have. There are some cons and I'm not gonna lie. There are some pretty hefty cons here we need to talk about. The biggest one being is the expense. Now, if you're not the type of person that's gonna go and take care of a pool by yourself by putting the chemicals in and cleaning it, you're gonna need to hire a pool service. Also, when you need to open and close the pool, same thing, if you can't do that, you gotta pay a pool guy to come do that. Also, you gotta think about the safety of it. You gotta make sure that there's a fence around the property. Some towns have laws where you need to have a fence either directly around the pool or around the property itself. Another con, you're gonna have the expense of insurance. Your homeowner insurance is gonna be more expensive because you do have the pool, which is a liability. So there you have it, just a quick video today to talk about the pros and cons of buying a house with a pool. Personally, I didn't buy a house with a pool because why should I when I have friends that have a pool? So I'm Jackie Baker with Caldwell Banker Realty. Thank you so much for watching today and I will see you next time.